so much of us better is about God. He came for Forbidden Horizon West. <laughs> Forbidden Horizon. Oh no, oh no, oh no, Farl, no. Itu siapa tadi? Siapa tadi? Cewek putih itu siapa cuy? Ah, you're awake. Tilda. You took quite a hit when Gerard attacked you. I imagine you must still be in a great deal of pain. I can assure you that we are safe. The others can't detect us here. You mean the other Zeniths? You must be Tilda. I wasn't sure if... Beta would have told you about me. Huh? Where is she? Oh, ini agak berbeda. And while she isn't where she wants to be, not in urgent danger. We must discuss how to get her back, of course, after you've shaken off the cobwebs. When you're ready, take the stairs down the hall and, and come see me. In the meantime, I'll make breakfast. Breakfast? Okay. Farlnya udah hilang begitu aja, nggak nggak kayak ada. Gue udah duga sih, pada saat Farl nusuk nusuk kayak gitu, cek 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 udah pasti pasti udah nggak no match lah buat Zin. Dia ditembak aja nggak mempan cuy. Terus yang cewek kemarin udah mati itu satu orang siapa ya? What is this? Oh my. Jeremy lamenting the destruction of What? Suara apa tuh anjir? Frenzy, dia demen ngoleksi beginian ya? Oh. Aku. I've got more important things to worry about. We both do. There is much we are trying to save. Not the least of which is in that vault. There's nothing wrong with savoring such treasures for a moment. Or come upstairs and we'll get down to business. Your choice. Okay, yeah, I'm a... you find us at the cauldron? Yeah. And what did you do to everyone right before I passed out? All business, I see. Well, suffice it to say we were keeping a very close eye on Hephaestus, knowing we would need it at some point. Your ruse didn't fool us, and as for my little trick, mm -hmm. it was an overload of the senses, accompanied by an energy discharge. Gerard and Eric were only momentarily disoriented due to their shields, but it it rendered you unconscious while I got you out. Perhaps some breakfast might steady you a bit. Farrell. Lu masak di mana dari bangunan kayak gini, cuy? This was your house. The one you recreated for Beta. In the data channel you shared. How perceptive of you. Please, this way. Ah, yeah, makan dulu ya boleh. After everything your people have done, you think I'm just gonna sit down and have a chat with you? They're not my people. They never were, and especially not now. Okay. You shot off and space with them, and live with them for a thousand years. Before coming back, he got better explain. What made you suddenly turn on them? Quite simply, this. I held focus. You repaired it, but 
That means you've seen incredible things. What you've accomplished in two decades of life. Huh? A thousand years at my back and I haven't even come close. Nemu dari mana? But I had to, in order to understand, to be enlightened. You truly are Elizabeth's blood, with her drive, her sense of mission, her integrity. Watching all this shamed me for the company that I've kept. Having seen it, all I want is to help you. Even if it means stopping your friends? Especially so. Please, sit down. Ya, itu ada rapi-rapi, itu dikasih makanan. Pisang, alpukat, roti, buah-buahan, sama muffins. Teh. There. That's better. Now, we must recover Beta and Gaia at all costs. By now, you must know that Gerard intends to use Gaia to reboot the Earth's biosphere. Yeah. Oh, gila. Ah, Remaking ray tracing. Remaking world to specifications that would only suit us immortals. This process will kill every living thing on the planet. He calls it a clean install. Not if I stop him first. Not if we do. And once he and the others are gone... We can work together to fulfill Elizabeth's dream. I'm sure Beta told you that there's a build of the Apollo database on board our ship. Oh. A complete collection of human knowledge. Oh, yeah? With that and Gaia. We could do everything Elizabeth wanted. Heal the biosphere, educate the people of this world, uplift them. Create the world she imagined. Toto de Embriana. Let's not get ahead of ourselves. From what I've seen, your friends are invincible. I do wish you would stop calling them my friends. And they're not invincible. In fact, a friend of yours has found a way to defeat them. Silence. Oh, he's been a busy bee, building an army powerful enough to crash through Gerard's precious base. Silent? Selama dia kerja di belakang kita? Regala and her rebels. Oh. Even now she's preparing a final march on the Tanakh the capital. When she wins, she'll have the entire tribe under her control. Hundreds of warriors and machines to throw at the base. She's been duped. They'll all perish, of course. But it should be enough to break Gerard's defenses and allow silence to kill him. Along with all the others. Using the new weapon he's developed. Yes, he's found a way to circumvent our shields. Truly an exceptional man. He's planned for everything except you and me. You see, while his army is battering down Gerard's doors, you and I will sneak in through a back way, one that only I know about, while Silence and my friends are busy battling each other. We'll take back Beta and Gaia. Jelasin dikit gak sih kenapa dia Kok gue jadi trust issue <laughs> Beta You said Beta is not in urgent danger So what are the Zeniths doing to her? Hmm. Putting her to work Merging Hephaestus with Gaia A difficult time consuming task as I'm sure you know They will compel her if need be But her life is not in danger She's the only one who can do it because you people made her to be nothing but a tool. Gerard's idea, not mine. Okay, who are they you? They always viewed me with suspicion when I attempted any form of kindness towards her. That's why I created the data channel. A virtual place where we could speak in peace. The Zenith plan. Beta told me your colony was destroyed. <coughs> but you came back to Earth because you had nowhere else to go. It's true. After we reached our destination, a planet in the Sirius star system, uh -huh. we spent decades building a new home. And then? The physical constraints of Earth, the boundaries of mortality, gone. 
think of what we could have done with it. It might have been a utopia. Instead, we stagnated, absorbed in effortless comforts and virtual realities. It took a cataclysm to finally yank us out of our stupor. What happened? Yeah, kenapa di serius? Geological event. Ma? We knew of instabilities in the planet core, but Itu karatan jadi pegang. By the time the collapse was upon us, it was too late to stop it. Only a few of us made it to the ship in time. We set course for Earth, the only safe harbor left to us. Which you decided to make unsafe for anyone else. Not me. Gerard. <laughs> He believes it's better to wipe the canvas clean than work around the smudges. No more primitive tribes, no more combat machines, only a blank slate to do with as he pleases but we will stop him all we have to do is get into that base terus tujuan lo apa masa lu se masa kita se segampang itu percaya sama dia my old focus yeah how did you find it let alone repair it when we encountered you at the hades proving lab gerard saw you as a redundancy i knew better you were a revelation After your dramatic escape, bravo by the way. Gerard and Eric assumed you were dead and gave up the hunt. I wasn't so sure. When the others were busy, I returned to the lab and searched for any trace of you. That's when I found this little treasure. Not easy to repair, but certainly worth the effort. As I watched your life unfold, you were like a splash of color on a worn canvas. What Liz was, and more. Did you show it to the others? Of course not. It was your actions that inspired me to defy them. It's worth noting that if I hadn't found it and watched its contents, I wouldn't have known to save you at the cauldron. You'd be dead. So I should be grateful, if you like. So jadi ada harapan karena dia ngelihat semua. Historinya Eloy Gak semua yang sesuai Gerard Yang pikirnya semuanya barbarian Dan semuanya perang dan semuanya gak ada perkembangan Ternyata ya ini Contoh kita, Eloy you know <coughs> Ya, silence Dia dimana? He isn't the only one adept at spyware hmm? You hacked his focus? <laughs> no, he's too careful for that But mm -hmm. his subordinates <laughs> Not so much Orgala. He gave additional focuses to the tribals he branded the sons of Prometheus. The ones working with Regala. Mm. By tapping their focuses, I learned about most of his dealings. The distribution of override technology, the arming of Tanakh rebels, and the secret pact with Regala to attack Gerard's base. Mm. But nice. how did he come up with a weapon that can take down your shields? Yeah, gimana cara? That's the one thing I haven't been able to figure out, but however he did it, I'm quite certain it will work. With it and the Tanakh army, victory seems to be within his grasp. Such a shame he'll be disappointed. Hmm, dia jadi punya teknologi yang sama kayak Far Zenith mungkin guys ya. Jangan-jangan dia Zenith juga. So you yeah. knew Elizabeth. Hmm. What was she like? Liz was everything she was. I see in you and more. Teman baik kayak Elizabeth kah dia? Abeta nggak kayak gini sih? Aku tidak bertanya tentang aku. Aku hanya ingin tahu tentang Elizabeth. Apa yang dia benar-benar seperti? Jawabannya adalah aku tidak tahu. Selama waktu yang aku berada dengan dia, dia selalu menjaga bagian diri dia yang terlalu terlalu. Like that from the moment we met. So lu kok masih bisa hidup gitu lu? What about you? So you know all about me. What about you? Ah, yeah. What would you like to know? Well, start with your life on Earth. When I was eight, terrorists flooded my home city. Thousands drowned, my parents included. I was one of the few who survived. Oh, wow. My guardian sent me to boarding school. 
among my peers, I was the strange girl, the orphan to be avoided. Oh, no, yeah, Timpiato, guys. All because Damn, of circumstances dark. beyond my control. Oh. So we're a lot alike. Ha, huh? <laughs> relate, ka? Aren't we? You were an outcast. But you didn't let that stop you from getting what you needed. Neither did I. I climbed my way out of desolation and used my wits to build a fortune. First from the technical analysis of art and the detection of forgeries. Profitable expertise in those days. But as it turned out, the software I developed was even more useful for counterintelligence. From there, it was only a short step to gathering extremely valuable intelligence on my own. You were a spy? Mm -hmm. More like a service one could turn to for information. Oh, double agent. I had to remain anonymous, of course, to protect my privacy. But despite that anonymity, Far Zenith inevitably sought me out. Ah, uh, did that. Joining the Zenith. What happened when Far Zenith approached you? They painted an irresistible vision of humanity. Yang pasti dia orang pintar, guys. Bukan orang sembarang. We need not fear illness or death. Where we explored the furthest reaches of the stars and thrived. It was only later that I realized that they only intended to bequeath this future to the rich and powerful. By the time I finally figured it out, the walls were closing in. Faro's machines were devouring the Earth. Mm -hmm. So I accepted Far Zenith's invitation to a birth on the Odyssey. I wanted Liz to come, but she had no real plans, as you well know. Uh, Liz nggak mau pergi sama Odyssey. Ah, yeah, yeah. The other Zenith. So you didn't know the other Zeniths were monsters until it was too late. I, I knew some of them were, certainly. It, it wasn't until we were off planet that I understood the true scope of their greed. I was grateful to simply be alive, but the others became obsessed with a kind of effortless immortality. They built a colony where machines serviced their every need, where any memory or fantasy mm -hmm. could be endlessly savored in virtual reality. It wasn't life. It was stultifying, a pampered dream state. As the decades passed, I withdrew more and more, alone yet again. But this time with eons to consider my mistakes. Now, finally, having met you, I feel like I have a second chance. <laughs> to do what? Help you, of course. G gimana cara dia dapat immortality tadi? <laughs> Liz's dream, which isn't so different from Far Zenith's original vision. A better future for humanity. At least they must have manusiawi, eh? What exactly is your plan to sneak into the Zenith base? We will make use of a lesson I learned Oof. in early age. Always know your exits. Uh -huh. In this case, a place where Gerard's new construction meets the ancient foundation, a passage that only I can access. Mm hmm. I imagine the exit. Flings his army at the base. We will enter through this back door, bypassing most of the fighting. The distraction will provide us with a window in which to rescue Beta and Gaia. Gak ada yang jelas tentang the mysterious signal datang dan segala macam. So when you met Elizabeth, she was what? Distant, aloof. Not aloof, not exactly. It was a summit in Paris about machine learning, a touchy subject in those days, because regulatory authorities were just starting to clamp down on AIs. Liz gave the keynote address. She had already achieved great renown for her work in automated environmental reclamation. But in her address, she was just starting to imagine the next step. An AI-driven system that wouldn't just act on its programming, but actually take responsibility for its sphere of influence. To care about life, not just follow orders. Revolutionary stuff. I was fascinated. And I wanted to meet her for a long time. 
I watched her after her talk. She had spoken with such moral authority, such empathy. But after that, she retreated. I could tell she felt uncomfortable with all of her admirers. It was as if giving the talk had cost her something. I didn't want to be a pest, so I planned my approach carefully. So how did you finally approach Elizabeth after her talk? I picked the right moment. The morning of the next day, right as she came back to the conference, she had just had her coffee. She was fresh, rested. Mm -hmm. It was like she had braced herself for the onslaught of colleagues. I asked if I could walk with her, then put forth a question about her talk that I thought was intelligent. Her answer made me realize it wasn't, but she was very welcoming, almost as if we were previously acquainted. It was only halfway through the conversation that I realized she knew exactly who I was. It was quite a shock to me. My business was trafficking in secrets, and I took great pains to protect my anonymity. So that was Liz, perpetually one step ahead. Ooh. I came to view our meeting as a metaphor for our friendship. She always seemed to know me far better than I knew her. I guess I know the feeling. Regala's only interested in killing Hakaro and waging war on the Karja. What does she have to gain by attacking Zenith? Mm. It's the price she must pay for her war. Without the ability to override machines, her little rebellion would have languished in the desert. So she trades with the sons of Prometheus. Machines to help her overthrow Hikaru. In exchange for an assault on the base. Mm. Pride has deluded her into thinking she can actually survive such a battle. And all without ever knowing who the sons of Prometheus really answer to. Ya biar aja Regala punya urusan sendiri lah ya. Kita pakai dia untuk nyerang <laughs> Zenith Base. Is what will allow us to take Beta and Gaia right out from under him. While hundreds of Tanakh are cut down outside. Once we're inside the base, where will we find Beta and Gaia? Here in the command center. By then, Gaia will have been reunited with all of its subordinate functions, including Hephaestus. What about the alpha build of Apollo on your ship? Oh, yeah. A simple matter of recovery once the others have been dealt with. With that in hand, we'll have everything we need to make this world as it should be. Dia gak gak. Maksudnya siapa yang gak mau bisa ngontrol AI kayak si Gaia buat ngebuat dunia baru. Kalau Gerard punya visi dia sendiri, apakah si Tilda ini punya visi dia sendiri kah? Serem gak sih? Aku punya trust issue ini guys. Gerard believes he's the most cunning of all of us. Even after a thousand years, he still can't imagine that I would outwit him. The channel allowed me to interact with Beta away from their mistrustful eyes. It offered us a chance to be ourselves. Until you cut off all contact. Yes. Though it pained me. I was worried that our meetings would do her more harm than good. Well, she felt like you tossed her aside. I was afraid the others would find out and punish her. She may not have had the comforts of friendship anymore, but at least I ensured she was safe. Ah, uh, yeah, not a I know it seems harsh, but you must believe that her well-being has always been paramount to me. Yeah, kalau nggak bisa dihitung ya. This place. Why did you make the data channel look like hmm. this place? I built this house as a shelter to weather any storm, a safe place, not just for me, but for the art stored below cultural artifacts of incalculable value truly some of the greatest achievements of human civilization and you wanted beta to see them yes her upbringing was so cold and technical i thought if she could experience vermeer and rembrandt it would bring something else into her life a heritage every bit as valuable yeah. as the scientific and technical. Tapi kan dia lahir kayak begitu si Beta. Lu gak usah apa-apain juga. I'm sorry I had to cut off contact, but I'll never regret sharing this house with her. 
She needed its shelter even more than I did. Okay. Cukup sih. So, how do you guys become immortal, huh? First of all, now Hikaru and the Tanakh. Your plan would wipe out an entire tribe. There has to be another way. We are in an admittedly desperate situation, but I assure you there isn't. Remember Zero Dawn. Elizabeth's sacrifice. Sometimes many have to die for a new world to grow. Jadi kita suruh gaya hidupin Farah lagi, selamat. Wait, the data channel. It still exists, doesn't it? I need you to open it. Let me talk to Beta. Impossible. We might be detected. It's worth the risk. There is another way, one where the Tanakh survive. But we won't. If the others... If you want to help, open it. Why? Sumpah. Eloy, we have to rethink about this. Kalau mereka, kalau kita yang mati, mereka udah gak ada harapan lagi, cuy. What are they doing to her? Virtual reality dissociation. The manual merge of Hephaestus will take hours upon hours of tedious micromanagement. If she resists the work, they run simulations to induce feelings of isolation and despair. Oh. Beta, can you hear me? Oh. You should have killed me. No. No, look at me. I'm coming for you. I promise. Okay. I just need you to hold out a little while longer and work on the merge. Gak suka nih gue bisik-bisik apa tuh kan yang dirasain buat si Tilda bukan gue. All right, I did as you asked. Now I think you need to tell me what you're planning. I'm going to take Silence Army away. I don't need it. Only the weapon he made to penetrate your shields. And how do you propose to get it? Ask him nicely. With Aragala and her rebels, he won't have a choice. We'll be his only option. Only option for what? What did you tell her? That is between me and my sister. Oh wow! Be silence only option for crashing that base. I'll tell you the rest later. But first, there are a couple of things I have to do. Oh. And what are those? Lay my friend to rest, and then I'm going to use the override that Beta gave me at Gemini to put an end to Regala's rebellion from the air. Wait. Since you insist on doing things your way, I know of something that will truly help you make a grand entrance with the Tanakh. The ancient Horus Titans still possess electromagnetic energy cells as part of their arsenal. Drop one of those on Regala's army, and they'll receive quite a surprise. No. So go, do what you must. I'll come to your base if 
You managed to bring silence to the table. Not if... When? Pasti berarti kita ya. Terus kita udah ketahuan dong itu. Aaron, are you there? Aloy. <coughs> Aloy, is that really you? Yeah, it's, it's me. Where's everyone else? We're all... We're, we're back at base. What happened? It... It might be easier to explain in person. I'll try to join you there when I can. Okay. We'll wait here for you. It's good to hear your voice, Aloy. Di mana ini? Oh my God, di bawah sini dong. No, masa begitu aja. Jadi itu kurang lebih cerita tentang setengah jam. They don't know about your base either, in case you were wondering. I sent you data on the Horus energy cells you can use against Regala's forces. Reach out to me when you're ready to acquire one. Understood. So itu kurang lebih setengah jam tentang apa yang sudah lewat sama Matilda dan hubungan dia sama Elizabeth atau enggak Liz tadi ya panggilnya. Uh, gue masih agak sedikit miss sih kayak um, kok bisa mereka jadi immortal ya, ya nggak sih? Born and born to survive. Kok mereka bisa? Little noble Joe, the leader of our Zinni faction, returned to the center. He was under the one of the richest, most powerful men with arrogance as match. Kok mereka bisa immortal ya? Gak tau immortal atau mereka... Nah, I don't know. Oh no! When you're wounded, you have to strike back. Draw blood. Hey! Can I get one damn minute to mourn my friend? Regala is going to slaughter my tribe to overthrow Hikaru. The Zeniths have Beta and Gaia. We can't sit around wallowing in our losses. Katalo's right. We must fight. Oh, all right. So what are we going to do, huh? Take on all of Regala's rebels? Not to mention the Zeniths. What can we even do? Throw ourselves at their base? Something like that. Oh, oh, mereka tahu tentang Farrell. So. Oh no, Farrell. After we lost contact with you, we regrouped and went to Gemini. What happened? The recording we found on Varl's focus cut off when that Zenith Eric. The Zeniths were tracking Hephaestus. When Gaia trapped it in Gemini, they... They knew where we were. After... Varl tried to stop them. They took Beta and Gaia. I only survived because one of the Zeniths turned against the others to save me. One of them? Well... At least we didn't lose you too. Oh my god, dia pasti berat banget sih. We're going to defeat the Zeniths. And get Beta and Gaia back. But first, we're going to stop Regala. How? Back in Gemini, Beta gave me a gift. There's something I need to do first to make it work, but it could put an end to the bloodshed. Word is, Regala's readying her army for an all-out assault on the Grove. I need to be there. I know. Go. Stand with Hikaru. And keep an eye on the sky. Strike true as the ten. Okay. The rest of you, whatever preparations you need to make, upgrades, resupplies, get on it. It won't be long before we take the fight to the Zenith. We'll be ready, Aloy. And when you're ready, meet me outside the east exit. I'd like to have a word in private. Even when things are darkest, 
You're the flame that lights the way forward. Just tell me one thing. Am I gonna get to smash up a bunch of Zenith bastards? We all are. Good. Oh no. Kok gua masih baper ya far like. I should check on Zo. It sounded important. <sighs> Doings of the ten. <sighs> no war. Kenapa enggak suruh Gaia hidupin lagi gitu? Kayak resurrection atau apa gitu. He can do anything. Ini kita dia bisa buat buat manusia baru. Kan? Is it, is it, is not, it's not going to work? Huh? Nggak gitu kah? Alright, kita ada 15 Kita bisa uh, I don't know Kita mau Upgrade yang mana Semuanya sudah Basically sudah di upgrade <coughs> uh, Tinggal yang kecil-kecil doang sih sebenarnya sih. Kecil-kecil uh. hmm, doang sih ini tuh. Dah mau apa lagi? Simpen, simpen dulu nggak sih? Wah, udah udah hampir mentok sih itu. Oke. Okay. Wow, what's this? Over here, Aloy. Huh? We would come out here to tend to the garden. Oh. Sometimes I needed fresh air. Other times we would simply sit and watch the sunrise. So when we returned from Gemini, it seemed fitting that he be laid to rest here. Now he can always look out at plain song and further east to the Nora sacred lands. He would have liked that. Oh. He often spoke of his sister, Bala. He said she used to gather her favorite golden blooms and tie them to her spear. Their mother called it useless, but. Bala was stubborn. Yeah, she seemed like that. It wasn't easy. But I tracked down the flower. Gathered its seeds. As Kuat banget sih dua perempuan ini. From death follows new life. So it is with the land. And so it is with us. <gasps> I'm with child, Evoy. I was going to tell him when he got back from Gemini. Oh my god, you have One day, I'll bring our child here. We'll sit among the blooms. Day day anaknya bakal ketemu sama bapaknya yang udah jadi batu. Oh my god. It's so dark dan relate ada beberapa teman gue yang seperti itu. Oh, 
saving my life, sure, but also. Oh no, baper banget, ding. For not giving up on me. He always knew. to look after them. I'll try to visit again when I can. But for now, I need to go to the fabrication terminal to install the new override on my spear. Then I'll use it on a sunwing and get ready for an entrance Regala will never forget. Oh no. No, no, no. This is so bapper. Okay, that's it guys. Uh, sudah GG ya, far lah berarti ya. Uh, and a little bit emotional. Yeah. Gua manual save dulu biar backup ada sebenarnya ada auto save tapi gua manual save juga aja. So, apa yang kita akan lakukan sekarang? Kita mau dapetin satu benda yang disarankan sama si Tilda, whatever it is buat ngebantuin kita untuk ngelawan Regala. Kenapa dia mau nge-stopin Regala? Mungkin biar nggak ada korban lebih ya. Jadi dia stopin Regala biar Regalanya nggak nyerang ke trap trap lain. Dia kan emang haus darah ya di sini ya. Bukan buat sebenarnya dia dia nggak peduli tentang Zine dan Gaya dia butuh semua tuh mati. Nah kita mau stopin itu juga. Fabrication channel. Oh, we got Sunwing. Nice. Then dari Gemini. Now to find a Sunwing. I think there are some roosting at the top of the mountain. So we're gonna find some Sunwings. Uh. Top of the mountains. Okay, I need to find a sunwing to override. Better head up the mountain. What? Ada sanu yang di situ sih. Kita bisa ke atas sih. Oke. Okay. Oh, gue tahu kenapa selama ini nggak ada data sanu yang mungkin. Abis ini kalau kita pakai sanu yang kita bisa terbang, ya. Um, ya berarti itu explorationnya jadi super cepat guys. Mungkin itu udah ya jadi terlalu gampang mungkin. Nah karena ini mungkin udah end game, dia mau buka semua unlock featurenya. Tapi gue lebih lebih suka Green Hawk sih, atau kan mungkin Stormbird kali kalau bisa kita nge-override Override dan dinaikin ya So ini mesti ada Sunwing di sini. Ah, there it is There's a Sunwing Good, there are Sunwings up here We'll have to approach them quietly. Quiet, but I need search more cauldrons to learn how to override that. Sorry, eh? Got it. Wow. Wow. Pterodactyl? Wow! Oh, this is new. Wow! Wow! Whoa! 
ahead, Rush. Tilda, I'm in the air. Then you'll want to pick up an energy cell on one of the ancient Horus Titans. But first you must send out a pulse to activate them. I've sent you the necessary software. A pulse? To deploy it, you'll have to override one of the communication machines you refer to as Tolnex. There's one in the middle of the desert. Shoo! Honestly. <laughs> hey guys, Igua, terbang! <clears throat> well, we're going to the tall neck. There's a tall neck. Need to get on top of its head. Easy. Hold R1. Now, how to land this thing? Ah. Bisa lah. Wah, ini mah easy banget kayak gini, cuy. Made it. Just got override it. Oh, ini tolnek yang terakhir. Uh. Okay, Tilda. I've overrun All the Tolmex. All Tolmex overridden. Nice. And the energy cells are now primed. Simply pick one up on Horus. The nearest one should be northwest of your position. Dropping it on Regala's machine should produce quite a spectacle. Thanks for the assist. I told you, I want to help. Sunwing! Wow, diambil pakai kukunya kah? Thanks, tall neck. Wow, gila ni keren banget sih. We are flying, guys. Kelihatan alat ya. Yuk, kita yuk. Buat apa bear roll ini? Kita nggak bisa, kita nggak bisa panah, kita nggak bisa ngapa-ngapain ini. Nih. Oh ini, The massive titan machine. Oh sih. Oh uh, tremortas ngeliat kita dong. Of course. Where's the energy cell? I don't want to take this back. Got the cell. Now onto the grove. Close from Tolnek should have reactivated all the energy cells in the room. Buang ini? Apa kayak EMP kayaknya ini, guys? Jadi regala nggak punya mesin mesinnya lagi. Kelihatannya sih kayak ini ya. Ih, kalau gitu mendingan kita naik Stormbird. Ini adalah override terakhir di game ini. Wih, bagus banget. Bisa bisa foto mode kah? Oh wow, look at that. Keren banget, cuy. Ih. Keren sih. Keren banget. Kalau bisa foto mode mah. So dia di The Grove. Kenapa dia deket The Grove lagi ya? We're alive. Itu dia Permisi air panas Deka Oh 
will soon be dead. It's all over, Chaplain. I gotta drop it now. Here it goes. EMP activated. Yeah. She flies in the wings of the ten. The tide has turned. Push through. Hmm. Kasih tahu, guys. Oh no, you don't. The wings of the ten. Kenapa harus mundur sampai situ sih? They're down. The machines, all of them, they're down. What? How's that possible? Regala! Wah, hero entrance. Elon, gua lagi jangan kabur mulu. Let's settle this, you and me. Easy to say when you're on top of a machine. Well, that was just to get your attention. I don't need any help to take you down. Fine. I accept your chance. <laughs> Duel? And once I'm done with you, I'll get to finish the slime. We'll see about that. The duel is set. Let none interfere. Oh, that's not your boy. I'm on. Let's go. Come here. Go gray. Hey up. Oh, nice one. Oh, boleh boleh. Eh, salah mana? Oh, wanjir. Ayo lawan gua pakai gini nih. Eh kenapa sih? Kenapa panah gua berubah mulu sih? Wah. Come here. Kemanakah sekarang? Awas tak kan? Wah, lu belum lihat panah maut gue, hah? Eh, tunggu lu. Wanjir. Panah lu sih curang ya. Eh, gue juga bisa nih panah plasma nih. Hmm, nah, enak nggak? Enak nggak? Hah? Hmm. Oh, spike thrower. Hmm. 
Weh, tunggu dong. Kalau itu gue nggak pakai senjatanya. Uh. This is where it ends. Yeah, we finish. Yeah, it is. Freeze one second, Goro. Oh, nice try. Oh, nice one. Mau mau bom out enggak? Tuh, enak enggak tuh bom out nih? Enak bom out. Ada S di sini. Easy said and done. Lo mau? Wah. Wah, konyol. Lo belum lihat? Ini gua nih. Oh. Gila juga lu. Cimit. Tangan sih, hah? Hmm. Ayo, lu. Dia lincah banget cuy. On my knees before bullets and cowards. Go ahead, run me through. Shut your mouth, traitor. It was you who flew in on the wings of the Ten. You who challenged her by our rights. You must decide her fate. I spared her once. It only made things worse. She was the best of my marshals. What a waste. She's dangerous, all right. But maybe that's exactly what I need. Cowards! What more do you have to conspire about? Whether you live or die, Dia, dia, dia terlalu terbawa dengan egonya ya. Hmm. There's, uh, 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 oh man, kita kita jadi orang baik aja lah di sini lah ya. I'm not here to forgive you for your crimes, but there's another battle ahead against an enemy more powerful than anything you can imagine. And I need people, a squad. That's willing to do whatever it takes. I don't want your mercy. It's not mercy. The battle I'm talking about will be charging into a nightmare. A better death than this? Yes. My blood is yours. Your enemies are mine. Meet us at our stronghold, in the mountains near Plainsong. You mean to send her alone? Without even an armed guard? She does not need it. I will be there. You have my word. 
I'll hold you to it. Ya trap ini megang omongannya sih jadi. Chief, there's something you both need to see in the throne room. Geger gala GG. Pertempuran antar wanita ya guys ya. <laughs> Alright, kita lanjut the next episode sih ini. What else? Apalagi? Surrender to our guards outside the grove. Claims he has an urgent message for the outlander who defeated Regala. So, state it. That it is for her alone. From an interested party. <gasps> A focus. I'm gonna need some privacy. Clear the room. Put him with the rest of Regala's soldiers. I'll see you back at base. Ya, aku tahu. Tangan lu mana? You saved the tribe. Let me help you with your mission. No. Jangan Gibi. With Regala gone, you have a chance to build the future you dreamed of. So get to your task. Then at least allow me to give you this. Apatow. Armor for the battle ahead. May it keep you safe. Thank you. <laughs> kan dikasih apa itu dikasih angin kayak guys tadi nggak ngeliat apa-apa kita. Oh uh. nggak ada orang. Hai, Silent udah lama. Oh, it's a pleasure to see you too, Silence. Congratulations on your victory. You saved the Tanakh for a few weeks. Unfortunately, you do the entire planet as well. Wrong. I don't need a Tanakh army to defeat the Zenas. Oh, Eloy. Have you learned nothing about the enemy we were up against? More than you, hiding whatever hole you found. My idea is just better than anything you ever came up with. Go on. No, not here. We're doing this my way. Face to face, and with the weapon you've developed. And why would I agree to that? Because I'm your only way of beating the Zeniths, and getting the copy of Apollo that's on their ship. So meet me at my base. Mountains west of Plainsong. Time to submit to the inevitable silence and follow the person who actually knows what she's doing. Don't be late. <laughs> Savage. Oh. Aloy, you return. Tilda, let's you check there? the outpost. Hari hari. It. Itu dia. Silence is on board. So head to my base. Rusak lagi. <laughs> Dirusak. <laughs> Fokus ya. So guys, oh, jadi fly. itu dia uh, progres kita untuk sampai sini. Kita sudah mulai mendekati ya. So the plan, the original plan ternyata memang untuk nge-stop uh, si Regala ini biar uh, dia bisa tunduk perang sama si semua klien di sini biar semuanya bisa diurus, bisa diatur sama si Regala. Tapi Si Eloy sama si Tilda mempunyai ide lebih bagus ini ide Tilda sih dia pakai uh, EMP dari salah satu ancient machine yang ada di tadi yang tadi kita dapetin untuk menghentikan semua robot di sana dan ngebuat Regala submit kekalahannya. So di sini kita mau membukakan sedikit mata mereka kalau misalkan ada musuh yang lebih penting yang lebih bahaya di luar kita saling perang suku sama-sama apa ya, saling perang gitu loh sesama suku. Come on, sama-sama tenak tidak perlu berantem dari sini. So jadi ini seru banget. It's been a really roller coaster ride di episode kali ini kita ngebuka beberapa uh, leads ya tentang si Regala tentang si uh, Zenithnya sendiri, apa yang dia mau lakuin dari kita pas itu in Hephaestus dan sekarang uh, kita harus nyelamatin Beta dan Gaia dua-duanya karena kita tahu ternyata ada copy of Apollo yang sudah disabotase ternyata masih ada di 
uh, di Zenith di 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 Odyssey-nya katanya di di kapal bekas dia atau apapun itu. So dengan itu semuanya mesti lengkap sub subordinate sub systemnya mesti ada semua di sana. Jadi kita nggak boleh kehabisan time is ticking karena gaya sudah bisa dapat semua subordinate. Kalau misalkan gayanya jatuh ke tangan si Gerard ini the, it'll be the end of the world. Ya, yeah, at least ya yeah, gitu sih. Semoga Tilda enggak macam-macam aja sih. Oke. Okay? Jadi kalau kalian suka sama episode kali ini jangan lupa untuk klik like, share dan subscribe channel Dijun. Kita ketemu lagi di video Horizon Forbidden West berikutnya. I'll see you guys soon. Never stopping in. Keep it slow. Bye bye.